Yes, today I'm going to show you how to put the steering damper on the Nami Bengi. Oh, inside the steering damper box, you have a steering damper and two bolts, one nut. And all you need is a 6mm Allen key and 5mm Allen key and the spanner for this nut. Ah, oh, Tyson. First, all you need to do is to fix position like this. The longer bolt goes to this end with the nuts in so here. And the shorter bolt goes into the front and uh, connect over there. And uh, you could tighten them up by the 6mm Allen key. The front, this one needs a spanner to work together on it. Yeah, Okay, then you fix the steering damper, the two sections into the scooters. The last thing is M5 Allen key, and uh, you can see the steering damper uh, actually moving around without this part to be seized. How you're going to do is make the wear facing front and try to say the distance of this side and distance of this side, and try to find the position which uh, have equally similar distance for the area like the steering damper will be able to move and you could lock the nuts up once the 5 milli allen key is locking down here you could try to move around the steering damper to say the angle was relatively similar on the right and left and you are good to go and on the steering damper here the direction of the minus shows less damper which means the Scooter is easy to turn. The direction of the plus goes to the extra damper, which is the direction will be harder to turn. And if you go too really hard, it's really hard to steering. And uh, make sure the bolt is fully tight. And uh, I do suggest to not put on steering damper or set it to minimum damper at the beginning when you start to ride the scooters. I hope this video could help. And regards on how the holder being fixed on the scooter, there's one holder here, it's two bolt here. And uh, this piece is made by stainless steel and holder here, fixed two screw here, and there's two knobs underneath. Thank you for watching.